The very first step in designing your own Twisty puzzles is to download SolidWorks. SolidWorks is a computer-aided design or CAD software. Basically, it's the software that you can create and design 3D objects in. Um, SolidWorks, there are a few ways you can get SolidWorks. Uh, one way is you can buy it. So they have it on their website. In SolidWorks, it, it does cost money. In some ways don't, but this way it does. Um, I'm a student, so I buy the student edition. Um, the student edition here is from... 2013 through 2014. So usually, if you can buy like an older version, it's cheaper. Um, also, if you're like in college or even high school, maybe um, a lot of times schools will have SolidWorks that they can give out to kids. My school actually, now I'm at MIT, they have it for students. So now that's free for me. I mean, of course, it's free tuition, but that's another free way to get it. There are also illegal ways to download SolidWorks. Um, pirating. I discourage pirating SolidWorks, but um, is an option. There are videos you can go to look at to see how to down, download it illegally. Um, I discourage doing that, but it is an option. Uh, also, it runs on Windows, so you need a Windows computer, or uh, if you have a Mac, you can either dual boot onto Windows, which I'm not going to explain. Uh, this really isn't something I'm good at. I don't really know a lot about that. Or if you also have Windows, you can run it on a virtual machine. A virtual machine is uh, like a program you can install on Mac, and what it does is it lets you run Windows in a window, so you can run Windows while you have it on Mac. So it's a virtual machine. You can run SolidWorks in there. So SolidWorks is a pretty big program, so it's important that you have, you're running it on a good computer. I mean, at first you're really not going to be downloading anything, so designing anything major. So I would say 4 gigs of RAM is plenty. Um, uses up a lot of RAM. Usually if you have a good processor, that's good. Uh, a graphics card is important. I'm sure that doesn't matter to you. Unless you get serious about SolidWorks like I have. You can pretty much use any computer. This is my desktop. Um, it's completely tricked out specifically for running SolidWorks files. So good luck with that. If you have any questions, let me know in the description. I'll answer them as fast as I can. Thank you, and um, should be a link to the next video.